Hey everyone, time for another episode of Weather 101, and this week we're going to discuss the Continental Arctic Air Mass, lowercase c, capital A. It is an extremely cold air mass, it is an extremely dry air mass, but we did see instances where it created quite a bit of heavy snow for central portions of the natural state and some just heavy, heavy snowfall. So why did we see that? I'll answer that question in a bit, but it's extremely cold, <laughs> no joke. It did shatter our record low minimum temperature for Drake Field, which was minus 18. Now it is currently minus 20 degrees Fahrenheit. That is the new record. That is bitterly cold air. And of course, it's Arctic air, and that is why we have the lowercase c, capital A. We're also going to go over the weather it produces. First, we're going to talk about where it comes from, the high Arctic. No surprise there. It usually develops in the Yukon and Northwest Territories provinces of Canada, and you can see eastern Alaska and northern Alaska also like to develop these types of air masses. Less sunshine during the winter months allows it to get colder. Also, we're looking at a lot of snowpack in that area, and that helps to develop those cold air masses, as you know. It is usually bitterly cold and dry in the high Arctic. Not a whole lot of snow. We do see snow from time to time, but not as heavy as we saw it across the central portions of the state of Arkansas, and that is because the air mass started to change. It started to pick up more moisture, and moderate is the word. Usually we see blue skies and sunshine, and it does look deceivingly warm outside. Case in point, this is Utkeadvik, Alaska formerly known as Barrow, Alaska. And you can see the airport here. We do have snow on the ground. We have freezing fog in the distance and blue skies. Let's bring it back home. Let's look at Tuesday morning where we had blue skies, maybe a little bit of extra cloud cover due to the modification of the air mass. We also had freezing fog right above the surface, a layer of snow, and even some diamond dust, which you see a lot of in the high Arctic. That's some suspended ice particles there, creating even some sun dogs. Parents, teachers, kids, have us a question? Send us one, weather at knwa.com, and we'll answer it on a Weather 101. See you next time.